Welcome to behind the scenes of my brand photo shoot. I am taking you guys through the entire process from start to finish. And we have my amazing brand photographer, Madeline Yates Photography on the channel today. The whole process always starts out with ideas and then I reach out to Madeline and she plans out our entire schedule based on the ideas I've provided and also helps me figure out some props I'm gonna need. And once I have that stuff, the real work begins when I have to gather up all of the props and sometimes even make them. For this shoot in particular, I wanted to incorporate a stool and the one I currently had was not going to fit my brand at all. So I took some time to paint it and completely change it to a minimalist, more aesthetic version of what I think would best fit my brand photos. It's crazy how such a small change can impact your entire space. Another prop I like to include in all of my brand photos is a mood board. And this takes quite a while to prep because I have to make sure I have all of the images that I want to actually use for the mood board. I also have to make sure I have wall safe tape, figure out where I'm going to put it, and then spend time putting the entire mood board together and laying it out perfectly so that it's ready to go for my photo shoot. These just came in the mail, just in time for my shoot. Two of my favorite client brand guidelines. About to open this up and take a look at them. Somebody stapled this one wrong, because this is the inside, and then this is the front, and then, like, who was doing the stapling here? I'm gonna have to, like, dissect this. I bought these specifically for my desk. I've had them in here kind of blooming while I wait for a shoot that's happening in a few days. I think they're ready to go in the office. It's officially photo shoot day. I am so excited. And I know what you're thinking right now, Kinsey, what is going on with your hair? Why does it look a mess? And I have an explanation. Basically, my hair is flat and straight all the time. So in order to get it not flat and straight without curling it, I braided it last night and I can't French braid my own hair. So my boyfriend and I together made braids just everywhere in my hair. That's why it looks crazy right now. Hello, I'm Madeline, Kinsey's brand photographer. I own Madeline Yates Photography, and I serve brands through storytelling photographs to help them bring more joy and life into their brand. I'm really excited for you guys to be behind the scenes with us today for Kinsey's second brand shoot, and can't wait, so let's tag along. You can just do a little ponder. Just a little closer, and then, um, um, can you take a sip of that? Don't make an ugly face, it would be not face. Oh, <laughs> that's some strong cold brew. <laughs> I should have actually drank it. <laughs> I always say, like, he, out of all of them, he could be a dog, like an indoor dog. <laughs> Random side note, I am so glad they had windows like this because I love the photos through the glass of people working on their laptops. This was a super unique location. It used to be a grocery store that was turned into like a little Airbnb type of place. Hmm, not the view I was expecting. <laughs>
So how do you want me to pose? Okay, I'm gonna have you put, let's do, let's switch up your hands. So let's put your right hand on this wall for me. And okay. then the other one could come over here um, onto the dress for me. Okay. And then walk down with your hand on the railing. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Look here, there you go. Okay. What has been your favorite shot so far of the day? Hmm, definitely between here and the ladder because you just wait to see it. And then the cupcake shop. So. I agree, me too. Agree. Ready? One, two, three. We ended our day around 5 p.m. and Madeline always impresses me by getting sneak peeks to me within 24 hours, which I think is absolutely insane and I can't wait to see the rest. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this behind the scenes brand photo shoot video. If you did, please give it a like. Go follow Madeline on Instagram if you aren't already and I will see you in the next video.